know many of you guys wouldn't care, but maybe you guys will learn and like to learn to cherish and to love those around you, even though if you hate them, just to love them, because like maybe you might not see them another day, and like maybe someone's going through the same thing, just help them out. There's something I'll be strange. There's something I feel, but there is no one I preserve. But there is no one I see. My vision came into clear. Esteban, Esteban, wake up, wake up. My sister wakes me up in fear. She told me to get ready and pack your bags quick. I asked her why and if we were late. Her eyes started shedding with tears. She told me to go sit my mom. I froze. I turned cold. I thought to myself, what is wrong? What is this? But I knew something was wrong. Oh, oh well, here's my day. Got up and started to realize what's up. The fa I got up in a breeze, the fastest you'll ever believe. I woke up, I woke up to my mother's door and see the tears on her face. I didn't want to see her like this, oh well. I went completely blank, she told me. Esteban, are you ready? Are you ready, son? There's no time to spare. I asked her. Hey mom, what's wrong? Her words come stuttering out of her mouth. Your father, your father is on a survey up, up so high. She told me, your father is on his last few lives. They don't know how, how long he's gonna live. I knew once something was wrong, 10 minutes to get out and out of the house. We were quick on our feet to get out. When we left the house, I saw it was 10 minutes since we got the call. On the way there, thinking about the difference it would be without a, without a father figure in the picture, I started to cry until my eyes were almost bleeding. Everyone in a panic. My life changed in a flash. Feeling destroyed and heartless, my heart felt, felt empty like space. Why? Why me? Went through my head. Ten minutes have passed. It seems this story is coming to an end. Something to consider those around you and to cherish them with all your heart until one day they are gone forever. Someone I considered like my best friend has found an end. 10 minutes and we got the call. My heart sank. <clears throat> Tears shedding down my mother's face, her words in, her, in a trembling voice, your father, your father's in a good place. She calmly said, he saved her away. On my mother's life, even though he's gone forever, and forever would be on my mom's life. I almost gave up in an instant. I was gonna run away and hope to see him at the end of my days. Just remember, if you're going through the same thing, just remember I love you and everyone loves you and you are not alone.